this one.
The best is together, okay? Thank you. Okay, thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, on my right, Linda Zaciri, Bulgaria. On my left, Sashina Vinesva, France. Sashina Vinesva, France, to serve. Love all, play. Yeah, very Sorry, welcome back. Over. It's our second One, game on two, court one. in this semi-finals day at the French International Women's Singles. Fourth seed for France in pink, Sashina Venus Warren. And in blue with black skirt for Bulgaria. Number two seed, Linda Zechiri. These players know each other very well, met four Service times, over. and the head-to-head -head reads two all at the moment. Two, one. Last win came for Sashina Vignaswaran at the French Open Super Series, of course, in 2013, back in October. And before that, in Spain, in May of last year, Linda came out on top in two games. So very, very little to choose between these two women. As of course is indicative of the world ranking, Linda at 35 and Sashina at 41. A little or nothing to choose between both ladies. Zachiri, who is defending a semi-final spot here from last year. So looking to go one better maybe and get to the final and Linda one of those Service consistent over. performers on the Four. on the Babington Europe circuit quarterfinal in in Sweden in January quarterfinal at the Scottish Open Grand Prix runner-up at the Bitburger Open Grand Prix gold probably her best result of the last 12 months Semi-finals in Bulgaria, quarter-final in Belgium, and the winner of the Hellas International. And as I said, this time last year, semi-finalist at the French International. So Miss Consistent on the Badminton Europe circuit, Zechiri. Sashina, on the other hand, has been very up and down in the last uh, 12 months. Last 16 at the Swiss Open and German Open. Both Grand Prix gold, of course. Semi-final at the Italian Open just before Christmas. Her best result in recent months. Matched by a semi-final at the Singapore, Singapore International Series. The beginning of last year. And her best result in the last 12 months coming at the Tahiti International Challenge 
in 2013 where she finished runner-up and already gone so much better than she did this time last year the French international went out in the very first round last year this year already in the semi-final In terms of their progression to this semi-final, Sashina defeated number eight Steed and European Service junior seven. champion Stephanie Stoyeva in three games Four. earlier this morning. And before that had a pair of wins over English opposition, firstly Nicola Selfentine before defeating Sarah Walker in the second round, 15 and five. Linda as number two seed took three games to beat Natalia Perminova Eight, of Russia and really that performance from Linda was one of the best I've seen from her in recent years behind in the second game behind in the first game behind in the second came back to win it and behind in the third and came back to win it showed really really good mental strength in that game of course took down wrong ball of the United States in round two and beat Fabien Dupre of Germany in a tight three-setter in the very first round, only coming through 23-21 in an exciting set. So on paper, probably Lin Linda has had the toughest route to this semi-final. But having said that, has come through against some really good players in tough mental battles. And they're sure to be full of confidence against Sashina. For Sashina, French national now. After fighting for many years for her citizenship of France. And uh, the ace in her pocket, of course, is the fact that she has this large crowd behind her. Ten. So good start for Linda Zachiri. Oh, Six minutes gone, Six and the Bulgarian with the interval lead 11 6. <laughs> and all the kids in the hall with the thunder sticks banging them loud for their girl. On the other court, Robert Blair and Imogen Bankier just managed to scrape through in their mixed double semi-final against Jorrit de Ritter and Samantha Barning of the Netherlands. The Scots defending their title here in France. And meanwhile, we're back with the women's singles. Linda Zachiri serving to Sashina. Linda certainly fired up for this match and it's a good start for the Bulgarian sometimes in the past Linda when she gets behind the head drops and it finds it very difficult to keep going and come back in matches but this week it's a different Linda Zichiri we see on court has battled back in so many hard fought matches The steely look of concentration from Sashina. Eight, 
Tashina while she moves so gracefully around the court I certainly wouldn't want to meet her down a dark alley those eyes would burn holes through your head so focused on her badminton Tashina Oh, nice double action hold down the line from Linda. Certainly playing with extreme confidence now, Zachiri. 14 9. Good variation on the serve from Linda. In the backhand. For the deep forehand corner, just landing out. 10, 14. Great atmosphere in the arena. My first time at the French International, but its uh, reputation precedes itself. Semi-final and finals day, 15, always a spectacle 11. of entertainment for the crowd here. Lasers and lights before play this afternoon. This tournament this week has had its fair share of controversy also. Many of you watching will uh, have heard about or maybe seen the YouTube clip where Russian Rodion Kagev played a drop shot with his hand after dropping the racket. If not, get onto YouTube and search for it. Well worth a look at. So back to this match and Sashina finding it very difficult to close the gap. Linda leading from the start, still maintaining a three point lead and good judgment again this time from the Bulgarian. 17, 13. Sashina willing that shuttle out. 14, 17. And Sashina just struggling a little bit with her length. 18, Certainly 14. not a big, huge arena, so there should be no issues with drift in this hall. Just misjudgment, maybe a little bit of nerves from the French oh. woman. And the drive cross court from Zichiri. An out and out winner. Five point advantage. It's Linda Sachiri who's heading towards the first game. And then making the error on the serve. Three point to Sashina. Superb net from Linda setting up the attack. Game point 15. Then going for accuracy rather than power with the winner. Net result five game points for Linda Zachiri.
Yeah, the lift very short from Linda and an easy smash for the French woman. Two game points saved. 20. Again. Game. It's the net from Zichiri who that is sublime. And it's first game in this semi-final. 21-17 to Linda Zichiri of Bulgaria. First game won by Linda Zichiri. Again, super organization from the French, bringing in the next match on the adjoining court in, in the interval. Play. This women's single semi-final, oh, pomp and ceremony. Lights and music. I'm already with this second game and it's first blood One. to Linda Zechiri and certainly Sashina not firing on all four cylinders at the moment. Basic errors now from Sashina. And already three love lead for Linda Zachiri. This time the error from the Bulgarian. First point, a settling one, point for the French three. woman. French number one, of course, since the retirement of Pi Hongyan after the London Olympics. Superb execution and the cut down the line. Service over. Four, two. Ooh. From a Bulgarian point of view, the shuttle just falling back the wrong side of the net. Oh. 
Linda not happy with that line call. I think more of a misjudgment from Linda. Five, Umpire. four. Definite in his support of the line judge's call. That's a superb shot from Sashina. In the push into the forehand corner. Linda, Six, four. even if she went for the shuttle, would have never got it back. Such was the accuracy from Sashina. And again, misjudgment from Linda. Five points in a row for Sashina after the, after losing the first three points of the game. Really a superb run on the serve of the French woman. And the momentum certainly on the French side of the net at the moment. Again, the poor misjudgment from Linda Zichiri, the shuttle a mile in in badminton terms. That's eight points in a row for Sashina Venus one on. And right now, Zichiri cannot buy a point into the lead for Sashina 11 4. And really, if anyone looked at the first three points in this second game, you would have expected Zachiri to go on and win this game comfortably. Raced into a three-love lead, and then only won one point from the remaining. And it's Sashina Vinas Voran with the 11-4 interval lead. In a space of just a few minutes, it's now Linda Zachiri. Who looks rather uncomfortable on court, with a lot of soul-searching to do. And that's Sashina, who has the pep court in her step. Two, 20 seconds, court two. Eleven four, play. First point for Linda Zachiri. Service over. Five, twelve. In uh, many, many minutes, her last point she scored was when she was 3-2 up and went 4-2 up. And that's a good angle cross court. And the momentum really swinging back and forward in this match. All of a sudden, three points for Linda in a row. 
And she's back in this game, as I said it. Another one drops out from Sashina, four in a row for Sachiri. Sashina looking for the shuttle changed. Linda quite happy to play on. A little bit of mind games between both women. Backhand block. I think Linda just 14, broadcasting eight. the fact that she was coming to the net on that occasion. Sashina reading it and pushing it. A winner down into the forehand corner. 15, really an unusual game, this second game. Great rally from both women. Linda forced onto the backhand side. And really superb backhand cross court net from the Chiri. The Chiri. But the winner from Sashina, really sublime. And the loudest roar of the evenings or the afternoon so far. 16 8. Now the wise money now will be on Sashina Vinaswara and taking this to a deciding game. Certainly won't write Linda off in this game yet. Saw her come back from 16-4 down earlier against Natalia Perminova. <laughs> and even the net is on the side of the French woman. And Sashina now playing with real confidence. 18, eight. Better from Linda, and that's something she needs to do. First of all, this game might be gone a little bit too far from her to come back, but... Uh, important to get a run of a few points get a feel get some rallies again and uh, take some positivity into the next game if it goes to a next game Sashina Vignaswaran just two points away from taking this women's singles semi-final into a third and deciding rubber. And I think Linda just been a little bit too passive at the moment. Ten game points for the French woman. Okay. 
And Zachiri not even attempting to reach that shuttle. We're quite happy to let the game go. Second game won by and it's one game all in the semi-final. And really, from nothing, Sashina has come back to dominate. And it's the French woman with the momentum as she goes in to the third game. And Linda will certainly need to find some of that focus and some of that resolve that we saw earlier against Permanova in the quarterfinal. And we'll have to come out fighting if she is to advance to the final. Seconds, court two, 20 seconds. So it's Sashina who's first back on court. A lot of discussions between her and her coach and Linda flying solo as she has done for so many years. Exquisite net shot. One love. But the shot previous to that where she anticipated the drive coming from Zachiri. Set up the win. Ooh, a little bit unlucky that time I think for Linda. And right now is the French woman who is dictating the play, who is forcing the attack. And it's Zachiri who is forced to react rather than be proactive in the rallies. Service over. One, three. And again, that steely look from Four, Stashina. Oh. Every shot now, a confident shot from the French woman. And with every point comes a fist pump from Sashina. And the shoulders of, the ch of Linda Sachiri just beginning to hang. Yeah. Yeah, 
poor error from Linda. Really has to start making Sashina work for the points. That's better. This time from Linda Zachiri. Nice execution on the pull cross court at the net. It's been a feature of this match so far is the quality of the net play from both women, it must be said. This is where Linda suffers sometimes against the better players. Really struggles to come up with a plan B. Which is really when a coach is worth his or her worth in go weight in gold. Better rally from the Bulgarian. The execution from Sashina on her li little stop net shots. Really a delight to watch. Something that Linda really needs to do now is close the gap before the interval. Put some pressure on Sashina. Make her work a little bit harder in the rallies. And in doing so, just get some confidence back in her own stroke. That's a terrible serve. Linda really lucky to get away with that. the battling qualities of the French woman coming to the fore in that rally Linda on top throughout the rally Sashina never giving in and in the end the spinning net shot Linda unable to do anything about it and it's 11-4 interval lead for Sashina Vinas Waran in this deciding set of this women's singles semi-final here at the French International on the adjoining court, it's Beatrice Corrales, champion from 12 court months two, ago, against semi finals Yuko Kazunose of Japan. And that's Corrales, who's on the verge of taking the first game in that semi final. Eleven four. Play. 
So it's do or die time, you feel, now for Linda Zachiri. Trailing by seven. Service over, 5-11. Superb accuracy from Linda, two points in a row straight after the interval. The fighting spirit again from Zashina coming to the fore. Linda certainly had her isolated in that deep rear forehand corner. Six. And really, when the shot came back, the loopy net shot from Sashina. Linda should really should have anticipated it and killed it at the net. But it's a confident player who's on top at the moment. 14-6. To Sashina. 14, 6. The backhand block cross court, another clear winner. just a little too passive in the rallies on the defensive not getting on the attack as often as she should be and then going on the attack in the wrong time with the backhand 16 6 Two in a row for Linda Zachiri. <laughs> really. Eight, seventeen. Play left. She was not there. And really, she needs another ten to get back into this game. Not quite sure what happened in that rally. Eight, seventeen. Sashina, I feel just a little bit distracted. Linda, no complaints. Quite happy to go again. Good control in that rally Nine from Linda Zachiri, but still a little bit tentative in getting on the attack. That's three in a row flying over the baseline from Sashina. 
really trying to force things now, Sashina, and get this over the finish line. Looking for the shuttle to be changed. The French woman feeling it just a little bit fast. Oh, unlucky, unlucky from Linda Zachiri. That time she went for it, and really she has to go for these points. But the first real rally we saw with a little bit of aggression from the Bulgarian. Service over. 11, 18. Two or three more points and Linda will feel she has a sniff of this and will be real pressure on Sashina. The cheery of all would have given, given up. But as I said, she battled back this morning against yeah. Natalia Hermanova. And why there's no reason why she can't do it again here against Sashina. 19-12. Yeah. Two errors in the row from Linda. And it's Sashina Vinas Waran. Point. Who edges even closer to the final of her home international. Hey. And that's it. Sashina, who goes through to tomorrow's final. Warm round of applause from the appreciative crowd here in Palais de Sport in Orléans. And such a turnaround from last year, which she went out in the first round. And disappointment for Linda. We stay tuned. We'll be back with an interview with Sashina very shortly. And the next match on court men's single semi-final. Markov against Savatsky. Sashina, good to see you here, and uh, I think it's a huge turnaround from last year. Yeah. You had big disappointment here, and now you're in the final. Uh, how does it feel? Yeah, it really feels good, you know, playing at home and then having the crowd back of me. It's, I mean, I lost in the first round last year. It was, um, I mean, I really felt, you know, it was such, it was so painful that I told myself, like, I'll come back this year stronger, and yeah, hey, here I am in the final, so tomorrow I'm just going to enjoy it. Yeah, of course, I'm going to try to win. Uh, having everyone at the back of me, that's yeah. great. Strange match at times against uh, Linda. 
Linda, we know is a good player, is a consistent player. Always quarters, semis and finals. And, uh, you know, when she won that first game, uh, what happened? What changed in you to come back? Well, actually, I couldn't control the shuttles at the beginning. And, uh, you know, I, I was like, um, there wasn't any rallies. And I knew I had to drain her out physically. But the thing is, uh, she wasn't moving at all. I was making all the unforced errors. And then in the second one, I tried to make her move. And there was one point when there was a ro long rally. And then she got tired, I could see. And that's when I knew that's going to be the turning point. So I stayed focused and then I try to keep the tactic, you know, make her move all the time. Yeah. A factor, you know, a real factor of your game is your concentration and the way you fight and uh, along with your technical ability, with your fighting qualities, everyone loves to see. Uh, is that something you practice, you know, fighting hard and keeping going? Well, I don't really practice it, but I think for what I've gone through in the past, I think that motivates me, that drives me and yeah, that's why I think I have this fighting spirit inside of me so it helps you know sometimes. Beatrice is going well on the other court and she's the champion from last year and uh, plays in, in, in France uh, in, in the league so uh, in Chambly so uh, they will probably, she will probably have some support if she gets to the final so uh, an interesting match if Beatrice gets there. Yeah definitely it will be you know um, yeah I'm looking forward to play any one of them so yeah I'm I'm just going to look forward for the game tomorrow and I'm going to give my best. Hey, Sashina, very well done and uh, good to speak to you. Thank you very much.